So um, a fellow van dweller decided to post a video about my current situation. Um, and it's a van dweller who I followed. Of course, I no longer am subscribed to his channel. His name is Anthony. His channel is called My Life on Wheels. And um, it was upsetting because, um, you know, he decided that he wanted to voice his opinion on a video instead of reaching out to me directly or even commenting on my video. He wanted to make his own separate video um, voicing his opinion about my situation. A few hours ago, I watched one of Chris Suvanna's video where she had to put her minivan in the shop and it cost $800 for her to have it repaired. And it appears that Crystal did not have the money or do not have the money to do so. Keep in mind that I am not judging anyone. I'm simply sharing my thoughts just like anyone else did in the comment section of Crystal's video. Let me start this conversation off by saying, I am an adult and I firmly believe that it is my responsibility to take care of myself as an adult. It's no one else responsibility in the world to take care of me but me. So I kind of feel like this was something he should have reached out to me personally and said, hey, Crystal, look, you need to get a job, which everyone who keeps commenting saying you need to get a job, please explain to me where you go to get a job the same day. Where? I have applied online and I have gotten no responses to anything via Craigslist, via regular applications, via CoolWorks. You can't get a job same day or even next day. It's a process. So anyway, again, I'm looking for a job. I do have a couple of feelers out for jobs that I could do online, but need a laptop, which is why I'm buying a laptop. Um, I one job that's very scary for me, but I'm going to try. I'm going to pursue it anyway, because it's something that I can start pretty much right away. And it doesn't matter where I live. It's all cell phone is um, basically <laughs> it's a um, telephone actress. Um, and I don't want to, I'm not giving the company name out. I'm not giving the name out of the subscriber who, um, contacted me about doing the job, but you're basically talking on the phone to men and the conversation could go towards, um, sex, but maybe it doesn't. So basically I'm going to be a telephone actress, sex caller something i don't know what to even call it but it's called a telephone actress is the title and we're ready to put your butt and mouth to work 